Hi Dresser Cuties, Wynn here. Today we're going to draw Fitzy from Super Kitties. So let's get started. To draw this cute cat, let's first start by drawing her eyes. So I'm going to come right here and draw a big circle. And I'm going to come right next to it, say about this wide, and draw another circle. There. So now I have my two big circles in. Let's make them draw so cute eyes with two small circles inside for highlights. And a curve line at the bottom. And shade in the top. And lines at the bottom. And same thing over here. There. So now that my eyes in, I'm going to come to the side right here and spruce them up with some lashes. So right about here, I'm going to curve up and thicken it up and shade it in. So same thing here. There. Now that we have the eyelashes in, let's go ahead and we're going to draw a small little nose in between the eyes. So say about right here, I'm going to go ahead and just draw a tiny little nose right in the center. And I'm leaving space around it so that I can uh, draw the mask. So just make sure you leave enough space. And then from there, we're gonna go straight down with a line and then curve out on both sides for the mouth. And cap it off. <laughs> there. Okay, so then now that we have that in, let's go ahead and we're going to draw the mask. So right above the eyes, not too far out. Let's just say about right here on both sides. I'm just going to go ahead and just draw a soft curve right in between. From there, I'm going to go up as if I'm drawing some cat ears. I'm going to go up to about right here and I'm going to curve down right close to the eye. So same thing over here. Just go up and I'm just going to drag a line across and approximately the same width, same height I mean. And same thing. We're just going to bring it down close to the lashes. Because we still need to draw the head so don't make it too wide. So then from there let's bring this around around the eye and let's come back above the nose say about right here just give myself a point right in the center and I'm going to draw a curve that comes down same thing here so just kind of round the nose and mouth and then we're just going to go ahead and connect it so I'm just going to come right here and draw a curve and connect there. So same thing over here. And connect. There. So we have the mask in. So then from there we need to draw the head. So it's even bigger, right? So let's just come to the tip right here of each um, mask, the tip, and we're just going to come out not too far, just a little bit. Uh, let's say about right here. And from there, I'm going to go ahead and draw the top of uh, Bitsy's head. So I'm just going to curve in and to say about my center, let's say about right here. I'm just going to give myself a point so I know where I'm going. Since I'm drawing pretty big, it's just a lot easier for me to see where I'm going. So that's my center. And then I'm going to come down just like the other side. 
and to my point right there. Then from there, let's go ahead and we're just going to go around the mask. So it's my usual dumpling shape. It's a little bit wider and narrow, wider on the sides and narrow at the top. Then let's bring this down. Then we're going to go around the mask still. And let's just bring it to say about right here. So I'm just going to flatten this out a little bit more and connect. There. So one big dumpling, right? <laughs> Usual shape I give to all my characters, the head. There. So now that we have that, let's go ahead and put in some ears so we know this is a cat. So in this space about right here, I'm going to come about, say right here, and just come down to draw some ears. Round off the tip and bring it down. So then right about here, we're going to make this thicker. Come down and this part is going to be thinner. So same thing on the other side, about right here. Just dragging some points, so just like about right here where the tip of the ear is. And once again, we're going to go up and down. So whatever is easier, so if it's easier for you to go this way or that way, just play around with it. And once again, I'm just going to draw the inside. There, so now we know it's a cat, right? <laughs> okay, so then from there, let's draw the body. So we're going to put a little tiny body, come about right here, right underneath the eye and here. And we're just going to go ahead and draw a curve. So this is kind of like the shoulders, arms, draw a little curve. Then from there, let's come down just a little bit, so kind of about right here. I'm just going to give myself a point, so like where the armpits would be. Give myself a point and from there, I'm going to draw a curve. So this is going to be the body. So I just know where everything is. There. Then let's see here. Let's say about right there, we're going to cut it off. We have a curve. Let's bring it down a little bit more. And we're going to thicken this right here on the waist. And then let's come straight down to say about right here in the center. And I'm just going to draw a soft curve right in the center. And this is where the legs are going to start. So let's bring this down and we're just going to curve in. And this is going to curve in and same thing here. There, so starting to build a leg. So let's work on this side. So I'm going to curve this down to uh, say about right here. And let's bring this down. And then about right there, we're just going to Pop it out a little bit and then draw these tiny little feet and then just connect. Nice simplified feet. So same thing here, just curve. We're going to bring this in a little bit thinner and then pop it out and connect. There. Okay, so we have the feet in. Then uh, let's see here. We're going to come back about right here. Cut it off for a boot. And same thing here. And then let's see here. Then let's draw the arms. So we're going to have the arms and have the hands come about right here. So let's come right about here and we're going to curve it out. Same thing here. Curve and it's going to get thinner as we come down. And as we come to about right, about right here down and then we're going to wobble a little bit for the hands and this is going to come down and just angle in and connect then you can cut it off right here for a glove and put a little line right there for a hand so same thing on the other side so very simplified hands so same thing bring it down to about where the belt is right here and then we're going to wobble. And same thing here. Just bring this down. And about right here, just angle it in and connect. And once again, 
little details. So then now for the bigger details, it's coming about right here. Draw a curve. And another curve. And then in the center, we need to draw their little logo. So I'm just basically drawing a cat head. So I'm going to come right here, right in the center. And we're just going to draw little ears for the head, the silhouette, and connect it. There. And then, luckily, it's a heart. So about right here. We're going to draw a heart right here. There. And then for some more details on the belt part, we're going to draw two curves for the center. And then there's these curves that come down to about right here. Then we're going to continue it and follow the leg. So same thing here. Just curve down and come out and follow the leg there and let's see here that is pretty much it for this uh, super kitty uh, called Bitsy and I really hope you love how she turned out and if you love this character and you want me to draw the rest of the team let me know in the comments below uh, thanks so much for watching and if I helped you today and made this fun and easy please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new Jurassic Cute videos see you later